Welcome back everyone to our inventory tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to be taking a look at how to complete the uh, inventory with the equipment. So to get started, we need to obviously first actually have some sort of equipment. So uh, in order to do this, we're going to go over to our panel. Actually, we'll add it into the general GUI and we'll add a VBox container. And then into this VBox container, we will add an HBox container then inside of here, we will add um, two different panels. And those different panels will be oops, the panel container. So I'll have a panel container. We'll also have a texture rectangle. And then we're going to duplicate this guy. Now let's rename the, the first one to head slot. And then in here, we'll put helmet. And then this one will be chest slot. And then this one will be chest plate. So this will show the chest plate. All right, next, we're going to duplicate the HBox container. And then we're going to put leg slot on this one. And then pants in this one. And then feet. Oops. If we scroll down a little bit, we'll put boots for this one. And then lastly, we'll duplicate the HBox container one more time. And we'll rename this to weapon slot. This will hold the sword. And then this will hold our accessory slot. And then this will hold necklace. All right. Let's make sure I didn't miss anything. All right. I don't think I did. Now what we need to do is we need to create a script that will of process the information of data inside of our slot. So we'll do this inside of the head slot. So let's go to the head slot. And inside of the head slot, we will go uh, new script. And inside of here, we're going to actually name this uh, inventory slot. Or did I already make that? Whoops. Is that no? Is that what we? Let me double check. No, we need a new one called item data, I believe. Which we don't think we have, or maybe we do. Let me double check. Nope, we do. Okay, my bad, everyone. We're going to actually just assign the scripts. We don't need to create them. So in the head slot, we're going to assign the inventory slot. Just double check. I'm not making that up. Okay, awesome. And then the script, we're going to assign the inventory item. All right, so let's do that. So this is going to take a second. All right, awesome. I probably should have done that before duplicating them, but it's OK. Um, but now, as you can see, there's nothing happening. So what we need to do is we need to actually go into each of these. I'm going to select all of them. Now I'm going to go into layout and make sure that they have a minimum size. Now, uh, 64 might be a bit too big, so maybe I'll actually change it to 32. Yeah, let's change it to 32 by 32. And then I will move the VBox container to right in the middle there. All right, so that is actually it. We are pretty much done. So at this point, we can actually just start loading in the information. You can see here that these are not the proper types. But in this one, I can drop it in and it will replace it, right? So this is pretty much our, our inventory, but finished. Now, the issue is obviously each one is loaded with some sort of information, which you might not want, right? So what we can do is we have a few options, obviously. Um, one option is when we load these in, do -do -do. in the inventory here. Why don't we try this? Let's try just resetting this. And it will error because of this. And it is because there is no data to do this. So what we can do is we can say, we'll only load something in if data uh, texture. Or to make it even better, I think we can actually just say if data, or we want to load that. But we'll just say if data. So now 
if we play, you'll see that it works without having to load. So now we can actually just go back here and reset each one of these. We don't need to put information in. And there we go. And now we have empty slots. And if I drop it in, you can see that it equips it. And if I try to replace it, it will swap them. All right, that is pretty much a done inventory system. Um, if you want to change stats, it's not too difficult. You would just do that um, as you equip it. Um, if you guys want any more requests or any other tutorial videos, let me know and I'll try to get to them as I can. Um, I will say that the best way to get to me and my requests are in my Discord. So if you come join my Discord, um, I'll definitely get to your requests more likely. It's more likely that I'll get to it than if you just comment or leave a comment. So I'll see you guys in the next video.